Hello everyone, my name is Danny. This review is for the movie called The Quarry. This is a 2020 film. It came out last April and it is rated R. It runs an hour and 40 minutes or so and it stars Shea Wiggum, Michael Shannon, and Catalina Sandino Moreno. The description, a drifter kills a traveling preacher and takes his place at a small town church, but the police chief suspects foul play. This does have about 2,000 grades on imdb.com, and um, it's just over a certain rating that makes me give it a certain rating. So I'll explain that here in a little bit, but this is The Quarry. Thank you everybody for watching this video. Um, I was falling a little behind on my reviews, so I actually watched this movie a couple days ago. Um, and my movie watching was accumulating and my reviews were not. So this is The Quarry. Uh, I did watch this just due to research, but because I saw that it was Michael Shannon, so at least there was somebody in here that I knew. Uh, Shea Wiggum, he's... Uh, I would say usually an unknown kind of underrated actor, but um, I would say he's the lowest point of this movie, and Michael Shannon at least adds something to this. But otherwise, it's a pretty disappointing movie that just has two names in it, and there's not much more to say than that, but we'll, we'll try and say some stuff here. Uh, first off, this movie tells you what's going to happen in the description. Uh, this guy is that's a drifter is going to kill this other guy and he's going to go to town and he's going to pretend to be the town's preacher and when you give things away like that sometimes there's nothing else to you know be told or be surprised about or see what's going to happen you know the rest of the movie and i think there's a little bit of that but it does have some interesting stuff to it the rest of the movie just not much because that's really the big enchilada and I wish they wouldn't have given it away in the description but uh that's just how it goes so then we get to the actual story and you know why people are not figuring out who this guy is what he's done why are they not capturing him and I think the theories about that are more interesting than the actual movie. I think there's some really amazing theories that could come out of this movie. Uh, the one being that because he's white, um, even if he were to do a crime, nobody would care. Um, I think that's open for discussion. And then the other one is just, you know, back in that time that they were doing this movie in a small town and that they are in, um, you know, with the impact he's making to the community, even in a false role, is that enough to have everybody kind of turn their cheek or, uh, you know, whatever, you know. Uh, I just think it's really interesting and compelling the strategy of what happens in this movie and why it happens. Uh, I think that's way more interesting than what actually happens in the movie, if that makes sense. So, uh, Michael Shannon, you know, he's always been playing amazing roles. I think that people can understand that this movie could be more, um, but he at least has something to it, so it's not really completely stupid, but it's close. So, um, I think what really drags it down is just the fact that we don't understand really what's going on, you know, and we, it's kind of the same thing over and over again, what they're saying, what they're saying, why does it take so long to get to the ending, um, you know, when it's just kind of an easy thing, I mean, the movie's called The Quarry, and people are around The Quarry all the time, so... Why are things taking so long to unfold? But uh, generally, uh, it's just a boring movie, I guess. Um, you know, it's interesting, but it's boring. 
So I am going to give this movie a C-. Uh, it's just above a D for me, which is my lowest grade. So, um, like I said, maybe stay away from this movie, but I think that it's worth a watch so you can at least discuss the ins and outs of it, but um, that doesn't make it exciting. It doesn't make it fun. It's mostly boring. So a C- minus for the quarry. Thanks a lot, guys. My name is Danny. If you like this or any of my other videos, try and get some of them to watch. Like and subscribe to my channel if you would. Enjoy movies. Thanks.